Hey guys, Seraphiria here, and welcome back to One Night. Uh, let's see. Yeah, well, when I last left off, I was trying to figure this out. <laughs> and I... I don't know. Uh... Apparently so. Well, let's see. Trying to figure out. Uh, see the new camera can do it. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you'll find the combination easy to figure out. Just remember the answer can be found in the file room. Use the dates on the archive shelves to help Oh oh okay, I think I see what I have to do. Hopefully you'll be able to hear me better last time when this ridiculously loud music decided to play. So I guess our objective is to turn the power on. Um, let's see if the file room was... I believe the file room was this way. I'm not completely certain. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Inside the locker. Okay, that wasn't so hard to figure out. Um, I guess I go back to that one room. These things aren't so scary anymore. I'm not scared of you. I'm not scared of you at all. You can't touch me. See? You're dumb. You can't touch me. I think I go back in here. I'm not sure. Um, what's this? Desk key, got it. There's a small power can do it inside. What? So, you of all people survived to this point too? Who's that? Excuse me? What do you mean by that? And who are you? That's an interesting question since you don't seem to remember. I'll tell you who I am. I'm Alex Marchani. I am. I was the administrator of this complex. Do you remember me? Uh... I thought... I thought we said something about that name before. I don't know. Hmm. Your name's ringing a bell. I can't remember where, but I've heard it before. Who are you? Why are you here? I see. So you can't remember anything at all. Just like Andrews. He was the same. Anyway, as for my being here, well, I'm here for the same reason you are. I was simply fortunate enough to survive the murders that occurred on that fateful day. Are you going to explain what this merge is? Because I'd really like to know. We aren't the only ones who survived, of course. Several others did too, though now I fear they are all dead. Everyone else, of course, was killed as a result of the merge occurring. What is this merge? So, I was here too, on the day when that experiment went awry. 
when whatever happened here happened. If that's the case, this merge you speak of must have happened not too long ago, right? Not too long ago? Aha, ahahahaha. Ha, ha, ha. Oh no, my friend, the merge itself occurred so long ago now that by all rights, we should be dead of old age. What? Explain yourself, person. Uh, I'm sorry, sir, but I don't quite understand. What do you mean? Oh, there's so much you don't know. I can't believe the processes of the merge could have affected you this extensively. Okay, well... What if I were to tell you that the both of us, and this complex itself, no longer exist? I would say that was weird. That doesn't make any sense. What have you been talking about? Was your name Alex? What are you talking about, Alex? It's all a very complicated bit of physics. We should not have ever melded with it. It all began when we began conducting experiments related to quantum computing. We were toying with the fabric of reality itself. So, are we in another world or something? Uh, we became aware that there were other universes, other planes of existence beside our own, besides our own. We at this facility, seeking the fame of scientific recognition, started to perform regular experiments, trying to cause a breach. we could view these other worlds and prove once and for all that we were not living in the so-called one supreme reality. Oh, okay, so when they say breach, they mean to look into other universes? So, emerge what they, the other, ver all, the other universes merged with theirs or something? Of course, then, on that day, due to my own human greed, there was a merge instead. But what is a merge? What exactly happened? Where are we now? And why has everything gone so weird? It wasn't done reading that. Damn, it's coming back. Look, it's not safe to talk here. Perhaps if we meet later, I can explain it all to you. But, look, I would just suggest that perhaps this is not the best time to be here right now. I'll find you later. Hey, wait up. Where are you? Little shit. Come back, I'm not done talking to you. What was that all about? What was he trying to tell me? A merge? I don't understand it. I don't either. I can't get it. I hear it. <gasps> god, 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 no, 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 go away, no, let me out. Oh, the power grid. 
so I gotta go back. Okay. Um, a lot of places. Pharmacy? Okay. Ah, I guess so. MHL 3 acid. The newly produced MHL series of reagents when mixed together under the right conditions can create a super volatile type of acid that can melt most metal substances. Okay, here we go. Mixing instructions. Caution. To avoid a dangerous overreaction of the HM of the MHO chemicals, the density of the mixture should never exceed 450 milligrams. Something. First, add the MHO base. This should take up 32% of the 450 something caution. Next, slowly add the MHO1. This should make up 22%. Remaining 46% of the component should be made up of two. Now place the reason common you've created into a chemical synthesizer to allow it to react safely and form the acid. Important note, extreme precision is required when mixing the produce blah blah blah. Okay. So what do I do? Wait, is this gonna be like a mini game or something? Maybe not. Mix. Oh. Crap, I have to do math. No, no, uh, none. No, wait, I'm... No, wait, I want to redo. No, this isn't what I wanted to do. Uh, I know I did. No, no. I know what the game over screen looks like now. Do I have to redo all that? Ugh! I do. Well. But, uh, I will be right back then, I guess. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm back. Uh, hopefully I got this right. Let's see. I already did the other two. Let's see. 46%. Hopefully I'm doing this right. Ah, alright, I did it right. <laughs> I remembered how to do percents right, okay. Well, that was nerve-wracking. Well, now I need to put this mixture into a synthesizer. Uh, this... Put it in. There's a sign on the, on the machine which reads synthesizing time equals 40 seconds per 50 milliliters of mixture. Ah! Ah, I got it right. It was 360. Okay. Alright, now that we have the mixture... What was that? Okay, well, we've got the mixture, so I'll go all the way back to that uh, chest thing. The trunk. It was in here, I think. There it is. Alright. So, now I'll just pour the mixture. The acid. Explosive. Alright, well, we have explosives now. Don't know what we'll use them for. We have them. So, okay. Okay, I finally figured out what I needed to do. Go all the way back here and use the explosives on it. It. Um. 
in the game for the day. Uh, I didn't really have a whole lot of time to do this today. Anyway, so... Yeah, yeah. I had to stretch. I'll just end this for the, right here for today. Uh, I know it's not a whole lot of progress, but... It, progress is progress, even if it's not a whole lot, so... I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully I'll get the video up earlier, maybe. And try to make it longer, have better progress anyway. Uh, thank you to anyone who watched, and see you next time. Bye!